Hello everyone, it's Lauren from SBO Hair Loss in Pleasantville, New Jersey, certified IHE trichologist, health and wellness specialist. We're going to revisit again some popular hair loss treatments. Today, we are going to discuss minoxidil and finasteride. We've spoken before in an earlier video about minoxidil. Now we're going to talk about the combined effects of minoxidil and finasteride. For those with androgenetic alopecia or a systematic miniaturization and a diameter change in the hair that grows on top of the head, minoxidil and finasteride are FDA approved therapies. Now we spoke before about what minoxidil is. It is a vasodilator. It helps to widen the blood vessels, allowing the antigen growth phase to be longer. So it promotes longer growing hair while you're using the product. And it has a lot of good benefits. Now it is FDA approved. And when it is combined with topical finasteride and finasteride is recommended by a physician or a dermatologist only, Finasteride is an androgen, a type 2 5 alpha reductase androgen modifier. So, this is going to modify how DHT works in the body, therefore, slowing down the growth of hair on the top, the mid scalp, and the vertex areas, the frontal areas of the scalp. Now, DHT, DHT has a lot of it has a lot of use for the body. It helps with forming sexual characteristics. It helps with the deepening of the voice. It helps with mood. It helps with weight control and uh, fat use. DHT has a lot of uses in the body. However, for those who are genetically predisposed and who are sensitive to their own DHT, they will develop a systematic uh, loss of density in the crown of your hair, thereby shortening the growth phase of the hair between the vertex and the frontal areas of the scalp. So with finasteride being a type 2 5 alpha reductase modifier or modifying DHT, should you modify DHT or try to find something that is not changing what is normally occurring in the body? I don't know. I am just here to disseminate information about the effects of minoxidil and finasteride. Now, when it was used in a study, it was shown that the systematic use after 24 weeks promoted longer, stronger growing hair from the baseline. So as opposed to taking minoxidil on its own, minoxidil with finasteride produced better, longer, stronger, thicker, denser hair. I will note the, the information where I received that here at the base of the page. If you need more hair growth tips, if you need help with any hair growth treatments or any advice, please reach out. We can find us at hairlawcenternj.com.